tank is emptied every day at a fixed time point immediately thereafter either pump a or pump b or both start working until the tank is full on monday a alone completely completed filling the tank at 8 pm so let's say monday a works for n hours to fill the entire tank on tuesday b alone completely fill the tank at 6 pm so n minus 2 hours been open for 2 hours lesser than a on wednesday a alone worked till 5 pm plus n minus 3 hours a has worked and then b worked alone from 5 pm to 7 pm to fill the tank 2 hours to fill the tank so a takes n hours to fill the tank n hours of a can fill the tank n minus 2 hours of b can fill the tank n minus 3 hours of a and 2 hours of b can fill the tank and r let's twist it slightly more a is doing 3 hours less work on wednesday which b completes in just 2 hours or b is 1.5 times as good as a fine very simple idea wonderful idea b is 1 and 1/2 times as good as a what a would have done in 3 hours b ends up doing in 2 hours fine or n by n minus 2 is 3 by 2 the time taken for b should be lesser the same ratio 2n equals 3n minus 6 or n equals 6 a takes 6 hours b takes 4 hours when a will take 6 hours b takes 4 hours or the tank is closed at 2 pm when they're together open they can in one hour they can fill 1 by 6 plus 1 by 4 which is 2 by 12 plus 3 by 12 or 5 by 12 of the tank or they can fill the entire tank in 12 by 5 hours which is 2 hours and 2 by 5 hours 2 hours 24 minutes starting from 2 pm or they can complete filling this entire tank at 424 the breakthrough here is in figuring out that the ratio of efficiency at the rate at which they fill b is to a is 3 is to 2 once you've done once you've done that the whole question become very easy the more conventional method say n minus 3 by n plus 2 by n minus 2 equal to 1 n minus 3 hours at the rate 1 by n per hour 2 hours at the rate 1 by n minus 2 per hour together they fill the tank solve this will inevitably get n as 6 and then we some complete it and solve it. 